And I'm drawing your attention to the absence of Manipur in the President's address. This is not a simple absence. It is a reminder of a Rasra Chetna which excludes people. You must realize that more than 60,000 people are linguisting in relief camp in a wretched conditions for the last one year. If anybody is read partition of the subcontinent, which I have done, I was associated with a research project. We have interviewed more than 1,500 survivors of partition of 1947, and you are witnessing the same thing. People are living in a wretched conditions that I cannot even mention here. 60,000 people homeless is not a joke. 200 plus people died. And there has been a civil war-like situations where people are armed to the teeth and roaming around and fighting each other, defending their villages. And the Indian state is a mute spectator to this tragedy for one year. I must remind this house that each and every square centimeter of Manipur is covered by a central armed forces. It is one of the most militarized areas in this country where you have more armed policemen than the civil police, besides the armed forces of the Union. Despite this, how is that 60,000 people were rendered homeless and villages in thousands were destroyed? And yet, our Prime Minister remained mute, not even a word. And the presidential address did not even mention that. Shame, 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 shame. And I said that this silence is not normal.